Yo, I ain't gonna lie. This is something in probably like a year or two that's gonna be very, very important to my YouTube timeline. And y'all are here to witness it firsthand. I appreciate it, for real, for real. We got another vid today, day 18. Um, I saw this and I was like, damn, I wonder how many kids really be doing this for real. But it's only one way to like, I guess really find out and that's to have metal detectors in your school, which I also think could be like psychologically bad because that's the environment you gotta go to every day. And it's not good. It's not good at all. But we got this vid right here. And we're about to see what's going on. The following was acquired. Conut coffee and donuts. <laughs> No person in this video shall be in here. Um, okay, back. Hi. Yo, body cams are so fire, bro. Like twelve fifty October two thousand twenty two. Hello. Who is this? Mr. Ray Sean. Mr. Tell you. I'm Officer Spells. This is my partner, Officer Carmichael. We're the school resource officers here. Uh to my understanding. But like, this is dead how the kids be in school with shiesty on, hoodie on, boo boo cap on. Standing, uh, the safety department wants us to come down to to, uh, to talk to you for a little while. Can you do me a favor and stand up for me? <laughs> right. And let's see. Why don't you come on around the? Yeah, you, know, you can stay there. Just, just put your hands behind your, your on top of your head like this. Do you have anything on your person that you shouldn't have on you? Any weapons, any drugs, anything that can hurt you, anything that can hurt me? Nothing? Okay. Nothing in your hat? Nothing right. in the shy seat? Just keep your hands on top. I'm only patting you down for my safety, your safety, and the safety of everyone else in this building, okay? You are not under arrest, so I'm not handcuffing you. W officer. Cause you could have came in our hot. Put your hands down. Boom, boom. Turn around, keep your hands on your head. Turn around. Nah. The shy Steve. He can't do hands I'm sorry? He has an old injury. Okay, that's fine. He has, a, okay. he has an open drink. Okay, that's fine. He has an open drink. And why was she so scared to say that before? Turn around, keep your hands on your head. Turn around. He can't, he has a, I'm sorry? He has an open drink. Okay, that's fine. Keep your hands on top of your head. Two hoodies, two pants.
Спасибо. 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 Keep your hands on top. Keep your hands on top. That's the first time he said that. Shit. Just say he dating. He's not under arrest. Oh, I hear the. Okay, 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 okay. I ain't hear it the first time. I ain't hear it the first time. Okay. But my thing is that shit could have went off on him, and he would have been whoop. Yeah, bro. Do you have anything else that you should have on? It's GG for my boy. Yeah, GG for my boy. And that shit loaded too. And that shit loaded too. Look, 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 look. Keep your head that way. I wonder how they found out that he had a strap on him, though. Like. Wait, because you don't want these to tighten up on you. Stop moving. No, because I need you to stay still so we can tighten up or lock those cuffs. You don't want them to tighten up on you. Give me a supervisor and an ET at the high school, please. Do I want a pound dodge? T. Uh, well, we know where y'all at. <laughs> we know where y'all at. <laughs> we know where y'all at. See why he got the strap on him. Yeah, See why he got the strap on him. He can rest. He will. We're good. I got him. Right, Let me double up the handcuffs so they don't get tight on you. I hope, I hope he not the one out here trying to like, you know what I'm saying, hit niggas and shit like that and just having that for his safety for real. But you can't be bringing that into a school, bro. You endangering everybody else, right? you know what I'm saying, you... So sad. It's so sad. It's so sad. Yeah. Let's charge your two felony counts. Damn. Damn. Ain't no calling your mama now, my boy. I ain't gonna lie to you. I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. Damn. Told you young niggas out there, bro, please don't be outside crashing out. 
I know it's probably easier said than done, but you don't want to be either dead or in jail because of some shit that you could have avoided. You know what I'm saying? Um, day 18 in the books. Don't be walking inside of school with a strap. Please don't. <laughs> now the comments, the comments got me weak. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Because what? I remember a time where where chewing bubble gum with a guy you kicked out of class. No funny shit, niggas. Used, I used to get in detention because I was chewing gum. Like. He's on, nah, he is on a good start for state Penn, not Penn State. I hate niggas. This fool should not stay in school. I mean, but like, tw huh? 23 years old. Yeah, I'm about this. what the fuck? Keeping the stereotype alive. Unfortunately, they can say he got two jackets on in the ski. It was probably 80 degrees outside. It's October, so I don't think so. That's how you know niggas just be chatting. Nah, yeah, I don't, I don't understand how, the, how these niggas be walking around with skis on inside buildings and shit, and it be hot as fuck. But... Oh my god. But I'm gonna holla at y'all tomorrow, this day 18 of 30.